And now, your selection. Meet the stars. French Foreign Legion. Yeah, we lost a lot of good men out there. Mount Everest? We lost a lot of really good men out there. We lost so many good men out there. Playing with the Yankees? In the art of crashing weddings. Sanjay Collins. Chuck Vendaloo. Seamus O'Toole. Bobby O'Shea. I'm ready to get drunk. John and Jeremy are the masters. You know how they say we only use 10% of our brains? I think we only use 10% of our hearts. So what was uh, what was the allure of this project? Did you guys know you'd come in together and say, we want to work together and do it, do it together? Vince and I had been in Zooland, but we didn't really have any scenes together. And Starsky and Hutch, we just got a little taste of the magic. Just a pink spoon, not the whole Sunday. <laughs> exactly. And with this movie, it was like, you know what? Let's give them what they keep asking Jesus. for. Jesus. I mean, Let's I would together. say. I would say about 65% of my fan mail started being about when are you and uh, Owen gonna go out and make it rain? <laughs> and I got tired of, you know, I answer them all myself, handwritten. I got tired of writing back going, you know, thank you, uh, Stephanie, I'm flattered. Thank you for the uh, Hello Kitty sticker. Uh, listen, me and Owen do have something in the works. Do not hold your breath. I'm not sure when it's happening. And, and so this is a great kind of please stop writing and asking uh, type of move for me. We are gonna have tons and tons of opportunities to meet gorgeous ladies that are so aroused by the thought of marriage that they'll throw their inhibitions to the wind. And who's gonna be there to catch them? Grab that net and catch that beautiful butterfly, pal. But now they're gonna start writing and saying, you guys were so great and we loved it. What's, what's, when are you gonna do a sequel? Like, it's not gonna stop now. Uh, Owen and I have uh, put a price out there, a magical silent price that the studios know about. And when someone uh, meets that, we'll, we'll see us together again. Vince always said to the studio head, Listen, you gotta understand, we enjoy working together, but we are not cheap dates. Oh, I always knew my first time would be on a beach. First time? We're gonna be so happy together. I love you. I'm sorry? I gotta get out of here, Prano. I got a stage five clinger. I need some alone time with her. I'm terrified of this broad. Here you are! Hey! Now, I've seen you guys like out and about at some Hollywood parties together. Are you as good of wingmen for each other in real life as Let you are? Let me explain something to you. This one here doesn't need a wingman. He's a one-man army in and of himself. Uh, you just try to stay out of the way when he starts flying all over the, the airspace. There is no one safe. Uh, he is like the guy in Top Gun that, that Cruz played uh, like 10 years after that movie ended. Yeah. To be truthful, uh, yeah, you couldn't ask for a better wingman than this guy right here. We're all going back to our little place on the shore, and it would be so great if you guys came. Really? Oh, I'm going to run it by my dad. Hey, don't, don't ask your dad. Don't ask your dad. Don't. You're going. I'm not going. Yes, you are. You can go if you want. Well, you're going to be. I'm not even going to say it, but you, you, you know I'm upset. And now Christopher Walken has become, you know, so popular with, with guys of your age in these comedies. Like, what's what's the appeal of working with Christopher? What does he bring to the year? Well, the appeal was to see him smile for me. I knew what it meant to him to get a chance to, uh, to quote him, be up in the scene with me. So uh, that was fun to be able to be a part of that with him. Yeah. He used to say big ups. <laughs> <laughs> big ups. No, she's not just another notch on the old belt. I don't even wear a belt. <laughs> Bellas. What did you guys learn from him? Uh, did he teach any dance moves or? Well, he's you know, a great he dancer. Actually, yeah, he is a great dancer. He's a wonderful dancer, and he's got a very irreverent sense of humor. And I guess that's one of the special memories that I'll take away from the movie. Everything's ready for the quail hunt. Ridiculous. Have you even shot one of these things before? <laughs> Ooh. Oh, no.